poncho here. This is White Sands National Park. Let's go explore. Alrighty, we have made it to the end of my day in White Sands National Park. I got my cheat sheet. Let's do what everybody is wanting to know. Let's do what I ranked it. So first off, 
is the location. I'm gonna give this location a seven out of 10. It's a little out there from the way we came, but there's a pretty big city slash town that's not far outside. Plenty of places for gas, eat, stuff like that. That's why it's a seven out of 10. Activities. This park is very beautiful, but there is not a ton of activities other than hiking and sledding down, which you see me do earlier, hopefully. The sun really messes with the recording. You can't see what you're doing. But because of that, I'm gonna give it a six out of 10. 6.5 out of 10, sorry. Wildlife. I know there is wildlife in this park and there's really cool wildlife in this park. That's why I'm not gonna give it an exact zero because I didn't see anything here. It's 107 degrees out today, so it's hot. That could be a, a possibility why I didn't see anything. But because of that, I'm gonna give it a four out of 10. Cleanliness. It's been a very clean park. I haven't seen any trash thrown everywhere. Everything's been cleaned up. The road's easy to walk. Nine out of 10. People, all the people I've met has been really nice. People in the visitor center was nice. People that's visiting the park, it is all good. It's, it's not crazy crowded either. So that's gonna be a nine out of 10. The major landmark of the park is these dunes and they are beautiful. I gotta say it is 10 times better than what Hot Springs had. No offense to Hot Springs, but I, I like these dunes a lot more, but I am an East Coast kid, so. But because of that, I'm gonna give it a 8.5 out of 10. Size of the park. I feel like this is also larger than Hot Springs and that's the only other park I've done to this point. So to rank it against that, I gotta give it a step higher. So I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10. Bathrooms, I'm gonna be honest. These have been the dirtiest, worst bathrooms I've ever been in. So I'm gonna give it a five out of 10. I'm hoping it doesn't get any lower than this at any other park. Lodging, I didn't see too, too much lodging. I've seen some RV parks and some camping. This is just driving in. Maybe a couple hotels, motels, but there's a little ways away. So I'm gonna just give that a six out of 10. You're gonna have to look around a little bit. Scenery, it's a beautiful park. I mean, I can't say much more than that. Because it's a beautiful park, I'm gonna give it an 8.5. That gives me a base score of 70.5 out of 100. And I'm gonna go ahead and give it a 19 out of 25 on my extra points on how much I enjoyed it. I liked it a little more than Hot Springs, so I gave it one more point. And with that, our total is 89.5 out of 125. This ranks it now the number one park I have been to so far out of the 63. This is number two. So Hot Springs last, this number one for now. See you down at the next park. I'll see you on the sunny side.